you do. I hate that lighting. Okay, Mandy Hop's here. I'm a little bit of a hot mess, guys. Let me explain. Let me explain. Um, You guys know I make like 20 videos a day, and I pick and choose when I shoot them, if I shoot them. And what's funny is I really don't even edit, so it's like, what the hell are you doing, girl? This is what you pick? Yep, that's what I pick. I tried to tell the stories of my life. I've been for the utmost pretty effing sober. Seven months clean off drugs. Yes, I smoke weed. Have I been smoking weed tonight? Yes, I have. I've already forgot the purpose of why I came on this video, but we're going to roll with it because that's what we do. And, I, you know, we like to talk shit out. All right. I shouldn't have said the S words. That's just going to be the amount. I don't care. I don't care. All right. So I'm watching the now that you're just somebody that I used to know somebody that I, and yeah, I am drunk. I'm drunk because I have no beer. I know, poor me. And, um, I kind of broke up with Boston John. He kind of broke up with me. Like, let's reverse it. And then he tried to, like, sweep it under the rug. And I was like, oh, you think you're going to do that? And then all, which I didn't even realize I had this many boyfriends. Like, not, like, real boyfriends. Like, boyfriends. I don't have girlfriends. No offense. But, like, all my boyfriends came together. And they fucking bought me tacos and beer. I didn't even have to ask. Like, what's my two favorite things in life besides boys? Tacos and beer? Why does my hair fall out? Jesus Christ. So, tacos and beer. So, they all bought me tacos and beer. And they all posted up. Ironically, I was the first one to leave. And they're like, stay out. And then, literally, my boy Catfish, who, like, beat up trash. He's like an old school hobo. He was like, dude, let's just get on a train. Like, just sell shook. Which is kind of the same thing my buddy Charles is trying to do. Shout out Puerto Rico. And I have so many like cool ass dudes that are rooting for me that like. And I'm not saying that to be like, like honorary or like stuck up. Like when I tell you I know cool ass people, I know cool ass people. And most of them actually are ironically military, but like, or just dead. <laughs> I know. But. When I tell you they want me to come out, they're like, let's do it. And I think they've been waiting for a girl like me. And ironically, I've been waiting for a dude like this my whole life. And then I thought I found one in Boston. And I'm still not ruling it out because I love the man. And you guys can clearly see my videos. It's clearly taken over my channel. I don't need a guy to take over my channel or a place or a person or nothing fuck around and find out but I feel like he took over for a reason and now um he kind of pushed me to the limit I think he was poking the bear I do the same thing with guys but I make very rash decisions and that being said that I'm so amped to go anywhere right now and try anything new and just push myself to the next level, uh, especially now that I'm seven months clean. And <sighs> so I wound up hanging out tonight with like one of my bosses, one of my street kids, um, one of my boyfriend's coworkers that I helped out a little bit today. And then like, it was a weird group. <laughs> it was the weirdest group. And believe me, all genuinely wanted to hang together. Like, as you get older, you know, you make plans, but you don't really want to hang with people. You're like, let's just go home. But, like, every single person asks the other person, like, hey, can we all hang out? And, I mean, I didn't even finish my, like, tall boy. I had a, a Modelo uh, enchilada. And thank you for... The taco, son. I have beef taco. Uh, oh, very nice. Uh, Mexican street taco. It, it was a weird scene. Uh, I can tell you that. But that being said, nobody had 
a bad time and um it, it was like you guys I literally have been on my own so long like and it's one night me and Boston got in a fight I know Boston or any other guy's gonna chalk it up to like oh they think you might put out and you know I'm not a, a retard like hang out with guys but at the same time my boys are my boys and they know me like so the second that happened, like, what more could a girl ask for three guys to be like, this is my homie, let's take pictures, let's buy tacos, let's have sweet tea, and just hang out on the steps. And then I left. I was the first one to leave. And everybody was a gentleman. And I um, can't remember the last time I ever had a breakup like that. Damn. I would have broken more often back in my teens or something. But, uh, <clears throat> another life in the day of the hops. Love you guys. Deuces.